Live from Columbia, South Carolina, WIS News 10 starts now. Welcome into your news at 530. Christmas is kicking off early at the South Carolina State Museum in an exciting way, Greg. That's right. Tonight they are lighting up the planetarium along with allowing you extended hours to explore exhibits, try food and have some new experiences. Our Judy Gatson live at the South Carolina State Museum and Judy, they couldn't have picked a better person <laughs> to light up the planetarium. Hey everybody, we are inside of the South Carolina State Museum now with the Planetarium Manager, Liz Klemek. Liz, thank you so much for joining us. You've been with the Planetarium a number of years now, and you all have a brand new exciting show. I should really call it an experience for everyone to enjoy. Um, yeah, we have a new show about the Northern Lights, and it's called Aurora, and it basically is a show about just what the Northern Lights are, goes over some of the ways various cultures have incorporated the Northern Lights into their, um, their stories, their sky stories, and it goes into the science about what causes Aurora, and then you also get to just enjoy watching uh, footage of the Northern Lights over Icelandic landscapes. It's incredible to watch and I know some folks are in the theater right now in the, uh, watching that experience and we have some photos that we're sharing with our viewers but when you talk about the incredible opportunity I mean obviously this is something that a lot of people have on their bucket list right to go see the Northern Lights but everybody can't make that trip but this really is the next best thing even this show it's unique to have it here. Yeah, it is. And like you said, um, not all of us are able to go up into the Arctic Circle and get to experience the Northern Lights. Hopefully this uh, show will inspire you to try to get up there and see the real thing because the show is beautiful. Nothing ever beats the real thing. But it is a very uh, great way to bring the Northern Lights to those of us who won't really get much of a chance to experience it. And you get to experience the Northern Lights in a climate controlled room without having to, you know, freeze outside. I know. So battle the elements right yeah and this show is great for all ages yeah it's okay. for all ages um, and we've got great feedback so far so everyone seems to really love it well thank you for all that you all do to make such interactive and immersive experiences here especially for the kids and get their interest excited about science and stem and all of the fascinating things that they have to tour in the museum how many shows are going to be running tonight by the way uh, we have two shows running tonight. Uh, the Aurora show runs just once, and then we are running a show about the Sky Tonight, our live Sky tour, okay. um, afterwards. All right, but the Aurora show is going to be here until, what, February, I think? Through the end of February. Through the end of February. So if you don't get a chance to see it tonight, you still have an opportunity. But tonight, the shows for the 4D and the Planetarium are $5, $4 for members, and it's pay as you may. You decide what you want to pay. A couple of dollars are absolutely free. We just want you to come out and join the fun. The live Live lighting of the planetarium is coming up right here on WIS at 7 o'clock, but you don't want to miss WIS at News at 6. The big guy, Santa, will be here. We have that still to come right here on WIS News 10. All right, thanks, Judy. An audible gasp was heard from the <laughs> weather department over there as Chandler 